Hi, I'm Jeffrey Lovett, and this is the Jeffrey Lovett Project, and these are the people that live inside my head. <laughs> hey, you over there. Yes, you over there. Hey, you over there. Yes, you over there. My name is Jeffrey. You're gonna love it. My name is Jeffrey. You're gonna love it. I don't know about you, but I know about me. I don't know about you, but I know about me. Yeah! Hi, I'm Jeffrey Lovett, and this is the Jeffrey Lovett Project. How is everybody? Wonderful, I hope. I'm doing okay myself. I want to thank everybody for making my premiere episode the most watched that I've had since this has started. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I did get a lot of positive feedback and I got a lot of negative feedback and somebody told me that I was being too gay and that my subject matter wise it always got to be about gay stuff and sex and vaginas. Do, what, do I have an obsession with vaginas? No, I don't. I think vaginas are funny. That's why I don't go into them. Well, you're going to alienate your audience, Jeffrey. That's okay. There are things known as gay comics, and we're designed just to make our gay friends laugh. That's my job. If straight people dig me, that's even better. But I'll talk about vagina until I'm blue in the face. I've only been in vagina one time in my life, and that's when I left my mother's vagina. And I come out like this, hey, I ain't going back in there ever. And I never did. Not even once. <laughs> I've always known that I was gay, and I'm okay with that. And we'll be right back after this message. Hi there, I'm Cousin Wilbur. Yep, you know me from ChristianShingles.net. Well, you know what? It still ain't worked out for me, ladies. I'm out there, I'm looking real hard for a woman. So jealous of my cousin. He had found his own match on ChristianShingles.net, and I had to go see for myself what his woman was like. So I ran on down there, I'm there, and I, uh, oh my lord, here he was. He had it up against the side of a tree, and boy, he was laying into that ass, and I could just hear it. And I was so curious, because I don't ever think I ever heard a woman make noises like that before, and I was just so intrigued, I, I had to look some more and look some more, and I came right up on it, and I was like, holy shit balls! I couldn't believe it. There he had that, that whatever it was, that he said it was a woman, honest to God, and all I heard was this, uh, uh, and I was just like, oh my lord, he done fucking a sheep down there. He had that sheep up against the goddamn tree. True story, honest to God, you can't write this shit down. And I looked at my cousin, he had his hat on sideways and hammering his sheep up against the tree. And I was just like, oh my Lord, he has his hat on backwards, kind of sideways like that little all hillbilly ghetto. And it was just like, damn, it was hot watching him pump his thing. Until I realized he was fucking a sheep. So I said, hey, you two, stop it. And he said, what? And then I said, hey, you two, now you stop it down there and the holler. Now that's just wrong. And he said, what? And that sheep was going, meh, meh, meh. And I was up back there, and I was looking, and I have to tell you something. I reached down, and I started doing this. I couldn't stand it no more. It was the hottest thing I had ever seen in my life. So I, I couldn't control myself. And I bust through the trees. I said, stop it, stop it. Get your hand off that damn sheep. And he turned around and said, boy, what the hell's wrong with you? That's my woman. I said, oh, really? Well, what's your woman's name? He said, her name is Mia Sheeple. I said, what? He said, her name is Mia Sheeple. He says, I found her on ChristianJingles.net. I'm like, really? He said, yes, because that's where all the sheeple go. To ChristianJingles.net. So next time, I'll see you around, y'all. You dig? <laughs> that cousin Wilbur, boy, he is a mess. And yes, he is cloned after a real cousin that I have. Except she's a female, not a male. Kind of manly, too. Last time I saw her, she tried to pick me up at a family function. <laughs> she said, you're not so little no more. And I was just like, hey, I gotta call my mother. I'm sorry, I'll be right back. Hi, I'm JJ. You might know me from the Jeffrey Lovett Project's Vagina Hoarders on YouTube. You also may know me from working the corner of Fifth and Main on Friday night, giving head jobs on the side of the corner, 
Or you might know me from my short-lived series, I Don't Give a Shit. And its sequel spin-off, I Don't Give a Shit 2, The Secret of the Brown Hole. Anyway, before we get started, I just recently had my lips done. I went for that Anna G. Jolie look, you know? I got this exciting new product I want to tell you about. I'm so excited about it, I can't stand it. It's called Jizz Active. Oh my lord. I'll tell you what, I come home feeling all manly. I put that jizz on my face and it just rejuvenates. I can feel it working. The jizz factor is off the hook. We spared no, no expenses to bring you the best jizz that money could buy. But wait, there's going to be more because we have three exclusive new sizes for your convenience, ladies. Let me show you the first one. This one's my personal favorite because I carry it everywhere I go and I get all excited about it. We call this one Little Jizz. Just look at it. It comes with the activating pump module, yes, and it's an inconceivable little bottle that you can carry anywhere with you. I can't get enough jizz. And I want more. So, we have the new dual pack of Jizz Active. Now look at that. You see that? This is some fucking jugs that i ever seen. And they're filled with 100% Jizz. This is Jizz Active. Pure and simple and concentrated for you. Dual packs. Yeah. Check it out. Look at that. Uh -huh. Yeah, you can get a two pack. Two pack it is. Not two packs of cord. They're two different things you realize. Because one's alive and one is dead. Too soon? Anyway. I couldn't keep enough of the Jizz Active on my shelves. So what did I do? I went to the local Costco because I knew they're colored. They're going to carry my Jizz Active. I just know it. So I got all excited and I'm running down the aisle. I'm running going, Jizz Active. Yeah, I can't wait. We got a theme song for this too, people. New Jizz Active. Jizz act, 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 Active. Active. Jizz, 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 Jizz. Active. Anyway, I got to Costco and I was out of breath and I said, where's your Jizz Active? And I said, honey, down aisle three. I said, where? She said, honey, down aisle three. I said, where? She said, honey, down motherfucking aisle three, you dumb bitch. And I was like, oh, okay, why didn't you just say so? Anywho, so they were out of my normal size, but I come across the almighty grail of Jizz. And now I want to present, ladies and gentlemen, Introducing a whole lot of motherfucking jizz. My favorite. Oh, it's a whole lot of motherfucking jizz. There's so much motherfucking jizz in here you can't stand it. Anyway, bam, there you are. Bam, there you are. Whole lot of motherfucking jizz. That's right. Bam, 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 bam. Anyway. Let's take a look at this before and after shot, shall we? Okay. Here's before. Okay, there's after. Oh, fucking amazing, right? That's what I said. So call that number you see on the bottom of your screen right now. 1-800-JIZME. That's 1-800-JIZME. One more time. One more hundred. JIZME one more time. 1-800-JIZME. This is JJ, and I ain't had this much jizz on my face since I was hanging out with Carlos the other night. Mm, mm, mm. Anyway, see you next time. Bye. Well, welcome back. I, uh, I'd like to talk about mixtapes, and for my young friends out there that are watching who never had an opportunity to have a fun time with this, this is an original mixtape for me. This particular tape, I believe, is from 1985, and I miss this kind of stuff just because, you know, this new stuff is so quick and in your face. It's MP3. It's not really. It's cold, you know. You just pay your money, download it, boom, there it is. But this, you could actually make yourself. When I was in high school, it was good stuff. Making our fucking mixtapes and jamming out to a cassette. You know, and listen to it now, the sound quality is terrible. And then when it would get all fucked up and the string would come out, you'd have to take a pencil or some other kind of sharp object and work it in there, and you'd have to tune it and tune it and tune it and tune it until you get it back and pray that the tape didn't fix. Well, we're going to be right back, my friends, right after this. All right, well, let's check the weather real quick, and I'm going to check in with Dick Ballsack. Dick, can you hear me, brother? How's the weather? It's really fucking hot out. Back to you, Jeffrey. Writing comedy is not easy. It is one of the hardest things I ever did. I could have 
footage after footage after footage after footage and shot after shot. And sometimes there are moments that are so funny that you couldn't even, it just came out that way. And I, I wonder where I grabbed it from or where it came from and I run with it. And sometimes it's pretty lame when you're imp improvising and things didn't come out the way you want to. We'll be right back. Jeffrey Love It. Exclusive. 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 Yeah, 2013. Let them have it, Janice. Janice. My name is Janice. I'm a VHS. I'm a vagina holder specialist. I deal in, I deal in the small, the medium, the large, the extra large, and oh my god, how did it get so big? You really need to keep the shit trim. It's not supposed to look like a fucking wig. Yeah, I'm Janice, can you dig? Yeah, yeah. Feel my flow, bitches. And I'm not talking about the damn flow. Oh my god. With the bag, yep, I heard all about your bag. Honey, don't put the things in the vagina, especially if it's made in China. Oh no, that's a communist pussy, you dig? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! It's time to open, open up wide. Let Janice take a peek inside. Surprise! I can't find, I can't find your lip. Oh my god, you is a part of a ship, really. This is getting weirder by the moment. Hey, oh, Janice, that's right. Your local VHS bitches. Right, I said bitches. With the lowest of, the lowest of the low of the low, low, low. Don't sign, cause they got, they got no place to go. Talking down, talking about and flow. Boy, she, and she's a nasty bitch. Honey, your vagina is too full. How's about we just take it, take it old school? That's right, can't find, find your muff. Honey, your vagina is way too stuffed. You better call, you better call Janice I can rap with the best of the bitches How's about some cream for the fucking fucking itches? I'm Janice, can you dig it, bitches? Yeah, yeah, can you feel it? Yeah <laughs> How's about we take it old school? Cause honey, we all know that vagina is way too full Yeah, feel my flow, bitches Yep <laughs> Word to your mother Word to your mother Peace out. If you want to feel good about yourself, tell somebody something positive today instead of something negative. You never know. That person could be having the worst freaking day ever and you had that opportunity to turn it around for them. Until next time, my friends. Until fucking next time. You're going to love it. That's why. I'm Jeffrey Lovett. And I'll see you next time.